Hey guys, so I forgot to film an intro to this video, so we're just gonna jump right into it. So right now I am putting on my foundation. This is the L'Oreal Infallible Pro Matte Foundation, and I'm using my Beauty Blender just to buff it all in. And then I'll be taking my Tarte Shape Tape Concealer in Fair Neutral, and I will be placing that in these spots on my face, and then using the edge of my Beauty Blender again to buff it all in. Puff, puff, puff is what my boyfriend would say. Now I'm using my Butter Bronzer by Physicians Formula just to bronze up my cheeks and my forehead. Now I'll be using my Kat Von D palette using that color just to sculpt my cheeks a little bit. And then I'll be using a little brush just to contour my nose. I just draw a line on both sides of my nose and then I will take a lighter color to place down the center of my nose and also use that lighter color to buff it all in. Then I'll be using my um, Pro Glow Palette by Tarte that my boyfriend got me and I'll be using the top first shade just to highlight my cheekbones and my forehead. Also be putting some on my tip of my nose, down the center of my nose, and also on my cupid's bow. And then I'll also be setting my under eyes because I totally forgot to be doing that. Then I'll be using my blush called Amber by NYX and just placing that on my cheeks. Now I'll be doing my eyebrows and I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. Now I'll be doing my eyes with my Modern Renaissance palette. I just took the eyeshadow called Warm Taupe and I'm placing that in the crease of my eye and then blending that in all over my eyelid actually. Just keep blending, just keep blending, just keep blending. All over the lid yeah and then I will be taking antique bronze from that palette and placing it on the edge of my eye and then blending that in and then I'll be going back with warm taupe and placing that underneath my lash line and then Cypress Umber to place on the very edge of my lower lash line. And I'll be taking Golden Ochre just to blend my lower lash line and then also I'm bringing it up to the top but I accidentally cut it out of this video. And now I'm taking some gel eyeliner just to line my upper water line rim. And yes, my eye looks totally frustrated and weird when I do this. And then I am also placing this gel liner on the top of my eye. I'm just lining my eye, then making a cat eye. And then you'll notice that I'm about to go in with some liquid eyeliner just to sharpen the tip. Because sometimes the gel will just not do the trick, you know? Now with a flatter brush, I'll be taking Cypress Umber just to pack on top of that liquid and gel eyeliner that I placed. Now this will make the eyeliner look a little bit more smoky, a little more sultry, sexy. And then I'll be taking my NYX setting spray just to set everything in, let all the powders look more natural. And then I'll be taking my CoverGirl Fiber Mascara. This is the Super Sizer. It's a little light layer on my upper lashes and my lower lashes because we're going to be putting false lashes on right after this. Now we're taking my Ardell Studio Fix. 
with the Lash Duo. The NYX Lip Liner in 810 Natural. And then also the Stila Liquid Lipstick in Caramello. Baby. Oh, it's hot. Well, what? Oh, Bessie might be going. Uh-uh. Mm-hmm. Really? Mm-hmm. For 6500 so since he came home, I felt a little bit awkward to film an outro, so I just did a voiceover. I hope you guys enjoyed, and please subscribe, and I love you so much.